Hi, I'm Bob Quillen, co-founder and CEO of Control Theory. Let's talk about observability and how to control it. Starting with the obvious, observability is broken. Well, that's not a newsflash to anyone who's dealing with the rising cost of logs, metrics, and traces, from ingest to indexing to retention to custom metrics and cardinality. The numbers add up. The result? Surprising overages and embarrassing bills. Valuable time spent tracing where the spikes came from and why, then explaining that to management and finance, not to mention siloed data, exploding complexity, vendor lock-in, and annual renewal nightmares. To make matters worse, Observability is not even delivering return on that investment. Where is the ROI? The mean time to repair is still on the rise. Root cause analysis continues to frustrate and key business KPIs remain hidden. So what if you could cut cost, sharpen operations, and better respond to change without replacing the observability you already have? Come check out Control Theory at KubeCon Europe 2025, where we'll be launching our new platform that solves three key observability challenges. One, cutting observability costs. Two, maximizing observability outcomes. And three, adapting to change, improving on simple one-way static telemetry pipelines. The control theory platform detects and manages log volume spikes and custom metric cardinality. It dedupes, filters, tail samples and enriches logs and traces, routes and stores telemetry and cold storage, rehydrating when needed masks and redacts logs for compliance, tracks offending developer deploys and commits, and avoids vendor lock-in with an open telemetry powered solution. We started control theory to help you regain control of your observability, to cut cost and continuously improve. Come check us out at booth S732 in London. Learn more at controltheory.com. Planning your trip to KubeCon Cloud NativeCon Europe 2025? Be sure to add Marantis to your must-visit list. Hi, I'm Grace from Marantis, and we would love to meet you at booth N331. Who are we? At Marantis, we simplify Kubernetes complexity so you can focus on innovation. Our latest open source project, Cordant, helps platform engineering teams create composable internal development platforms at scale in the Kubernetes native way with powerful automation, policy-driven controls, and streamlined cluster management across any infrastructure. This year at KubeCon, we are excited to showcase Cordant in action. Our live demo will show you how Cordant helps you tame infrastructure sprawl, improve operational efficiency, and accelerate delivery of your AI workloads, whether you're managing on-premises, cloud, or edge environments. We're also hosting a fun Kubernetes quiz at our booth, so test your knowledge for a chance to win a limited edition skateboard deck or grab one of our exclusive Mirantis t-shirts to show off your Kubernetes pride. And don't miss a keynote by Randy Bias, our VP of Open Source Strategy and Technology on redefining ML ops with Kubernetes. Plus, join senior DevOps engineer Prashram Heat's exciting lightning talk about using Kubernetes for edge computing in the ocean for real-time monitoring of CLG and coral growth. Morantis is thrilled to be part of KubeCon once again, and we can't wait to meet you at booth N331. See you in London. Hi, KubeCon. This is Dan Cerulli from Nutanix, and we're here talking to companies about how we can help them run Kubernetes consistently in hybrid and multi-cloud environments. Nutanix is hyper-converged infrastructure. It features virtualization and storage in one software package that can run both on-premises and in the cloud. And in the last year, we added NKP, the Nutanix Kubernetes platform, to Nutanix. NKP is a pure upstream Kubernetes distribution that contains a production-ready stack of applications from the CNCF. Things like Istio, Prometheus, Grafana, Dex, all the things you need to go to production. And it has a set of tools for managing 
Kubernetes clusters regardless of where they're running, on-premises, on Nutanix, on vSphere, on bare metal, or in any of the three major clouds. This means we give you that production-ready stack, something that upgrades as a single unit, keeps you current with all the latest innovations in the CNCF, and it does it consistently everywhere you're running. So you don't get lots of the operational overload that the companies get when they try to run Kubernetes differently on-premises uh, and in the cloud. Because this runs uh, both on-prem and at the edge and in the cloud, we can really help you do everything the same way no matter where you're running it. And that operational consistency can be a huge, huge benefit to our customers. And because it comes with Nutanix and hyper-converged infrastructure, it means this is equally good at running virtualized workloads as it is at running containerized workloads. So if you're wrestling with running some stuff in containers and some stuff in VMs, and if you're running things in the cloud and also on-prem, we really feel like what Nutanix has to offer with NKP can really help you out. Stop by the Nutanix booth and we'll tell you all about it. Um, I uh, am a, a founder of uh, Victoria Metrics company, uh, and uh, this company uh, provides an open source observability solutions. Uh, we started with uh, metrics solution, solution for metrics, uh, which is named Victoria Metrics uh, after the company name. And uh, this open source solution for metrics uh, is compatible mostly with Prometheus. Uh, it can be used as drop-in replacement uh, for Prometheus, another open source uh, observability solution for metrics. It's optimized version of Prometheus, I would say, because it needs less uh, compute resources, less memory, less CPU, less disk space uh, than Prometheus. That's why uh, users who struggle with uh, Prometheus scalability uh, usually become uh, users of Victoria metrics and they are happy with Victoria metrics. Uh, so, and uh, a few years ago, uh, our users were asking us for uh, starting uh, work on a solution for logs because uh, the current, uh, the existing solutions for logs in open source uh, are not so good. Uh, and that's why we started uh, working on the solution for logs. And this solution uh, is already uh, production ready. It is named uh, Victoria Logs. Uh, the main uh, selling point of Victoria Logs uh, uh, is it is uh, much, much easier to uh, configure and operate uh, compared to Elasticsearch and Loki. Mm -hmm. um, the best way is to visit our GitHub uh, website, our documentation, uh, and uh, start using, try using uh, Victoria Metrics products. Uh, we try uh, hard to simplify this uh, getting started guide, to get the starting experience for end users, and simplify this uh, getting started guide, to get the starting experience for end users, and everybody uh, who is curious uh, about observability, uh, who has uh, some uh, issues with existing observability solutions, uh, to try uh, Victoria Metrics products and uh, Victoria Logs uh, too. Greetings, KubeCon attendees. Tintree was founded in 2008 with the purpose of improving the ways that teams manage and store data. Traditional storage is plagued with challenges. Managing LUNs and volumes causes complexity, poor visibility, and resource contention. Setting out to solve these challenges, Tintree created its flagship product, the VM Store platform. The VM Store is a 2U appliance powered by NVMe with AI and machine learning baked right into the software layer. Core innovations in the early years were focused on VMware at the virtual machine level, solving performance, visibility, and management issues. While others are still trying to figure out why their applications are running poorly, our unique approach to serve I.O. at the individual workload level has already solved this problem. VM Store's deep understanding of workloads provides optimized performance with AI-based quality of service, observability, and built-in data protection, all at the workload level, which no other platform can do. Over time, we've added workloads like VDI, SQL Database, and most recently, Kubernetes. VM Store is hypervisor agnostic, so you can run VMware, Hyper-V, Citrix Zen Server, or others. 
Stop by our booth, S341, to check out our rockin' tech as Tintree's Data Disruptor World Tour turns KubeCon up to 11. We'll be hosting a series of interactive demo sessions highlighting how Tintree technology allows customers to solve their complex data challenges. Everyone who stops by will be able to pick up some awesome concert theme swag, exclusive Tintree vinyl records, and enter to win Lego sets and Tintree branded record players. Hope to see you there.